Hey, what's up functional bodybuilders? We're gonna review the sumo deadlift. Uh, specifically today, we're gonna be looking at foot placement and then hips, shoulder, relative placement when you set up for your sumo deadlift. Now, uh, we've covered this in a previous coach breakdown, talked about why we sumo deadlift, some of the ad uh, advantages of it. Uh, today, specifically, what I wanna look at is how wide, where should you start with your foot position. Now, because every single person that is gonna be approaching this exercise in our training program is shaped a little bit differently, different limb lengths, different leg, femur, uh, tibia lengths, etc. You might find that what I say today doesn't work perfectly for you, but this is a good starting place. And then from there, you can kind of work your way outwards, inwards, hips up and down a little bit to find what, what feels the strongest and safest for you. Uh, what I would say for a starting position with the foot width is I want you, you know, if I look, if I, if I hold my arm straight down, that would be considered shoulder width. Okay. We're going to double that width. If you double shoulder width, I think you'll find you're in a pretty good position to start sumo deadlifting. For me, if I'm standing over the bar, I look down and these little, uh, you know, most barbells have a little ring right here. My foot, the inside of my foot lines up with that outer ring. The other question is, should my feet be forward or should they be turned out? and uh, definitely turned out, okay? Uh, feet forward is not gonna allow you to really leverage the right muscles and get your knees tracking in the direction that we want them to, to make the sumo deadlift as advantageous as it can be. So we're turning our feet out. How wide should you turn your feet out? I would start with maybe about 45 degrees. So this is straight forward. This is all the way out at 90, <laughs> right in the middle, okay? So we double our foot, our shoulder width, we turn out 45, and now we're gonna go into our setup. When we set up for a deadlift, people talk about this, th these two positions. There's the shoulder and the hip. Where should they be relative to each other, and where should they be relative to the bar? So with a, with a traditional deadlift, we might have our shoulders out over the bar and our hips a little bit higher. With a sumo deadlift, I want your hips to be a little bit lower and your shoulders to be a little bit more over the bar. That's kind of the best starting place that I can think of is as I go down, my shoulders are more or less right over the bar. I'm not behind the bar and I'm not in front of the bar. I'm just over the bar. My hips are down and my knees are tracking out where my toes are as I discussed before. So this is our starting position. This is our foot position, turnout. If you wanna start there, you might find that you feel a little bit better going slightly wider, slightly narrower with your feet. You might find that you actually feel better a little bit more upright or a little bit more forward. But as a starting point, shoulder right over the bar, knees wide. I hope that helps. If you have questions, drop them in the comments. Good luck sumo deadlifting. I'll see you next time.